Hello and welcome back to our channel. Today we have something kind of fun. This is a special doll for me. This was given to me by my son as a gift. And she is one of the first original three that were released. It was Samantha, Molly, and Kirsten. And I had been looking for a Kirsten to add to my collection. And my oldest son bought her for me as a surprise gift. So, so special, guys. So this is her in her current state as I got her, except I did manage to find her some boots because she didn't come with her boots. But what I thought would be fun is to do something kind of fun, like as if Kirsten were to time travel into today. First, we're gonna get her all cleaned up, and then you guys are gonna get to see if you think the outfits would be something that Kirsten would wear if she was a girl of 2021. So are you ready? Let's go get her cleaned up first. She is cleaned up so nice. And I wanted to show you before we start her hair, she doesn't have the body tag. So she is one of the older Pleasant Company dolls. Here's her marking on the back. So you can see there the Pleasant Company marking. These are the braids that they had her in, but we are gonna take it down and maybe give her a little bit of a different style for something fun. And then we can always put it back up into her, her normal ring braids. And if you want to see a video on us doing that, make sure to give us a great big thumbs up so we know that you want to see more with Kirsten here so oh I wanted to show you I did add a little bit just a little touch of color back to her face she was very muted she was all basically a one color and um, that kind of happens because a lot of these dolls don't have tons of color anyway the older ones and then it fades and rubs off but really for the most part I mean her bangs and everything look to be pretty good so let's go ahead and we'll start taking out her braids and then we will start changing out her wardrobe all right, so it looks like what they did is they had double ring braids, and it's actually really cute like that. They're not so bulky. I kind of like that option, but let's go ahead and take these rubber bands out. Now, this is interesting. Look at her hair. Her hair is so, so soft. And the ends are in remarkably good shape, but you know why? I think her hair's been trimmed because pictures that I generally see of Kirsten, I mean, her hair goes way down. I mean, I'm thinking we probably got this much at least cut off, but I know that this is a Kirsten wig because it's got the short hairs in it. So that's really interesting. I You couldn't tell with the braids that it had been um, trimmed, but maybe that was a sign why they were so petite. I liked them. You know, when you're, you're buying a doll and you know, you don't know if they've had a trim or not. And of course, you know, she was a gift. And so it doesn't matter to me because I love her so because of that. Anyway, let's go ahead and spray her hair. Let me get my spray bottle here and we'll just, spray and then we'll brush her out we're gonna have to come up with a style for her that we want to put her in then we'll start trying outfits on her and see if she can fit in to modern day styles let's go ahead and finish getting her brushed out and then we'll start styling all right, so looky here. We've got her hair styled in um, kind of a side swept Dutch braid coming down to a side topsy tail pony right there. So that's kind of a fun new style for her since she's gonna be trying on some fun new clothes. And you know, I'm thinking about we might do um, a video that shows how we did the hairstyle. So you can always leave us a thumbs up and let us know that you would like to see exactly maybe that this hairstyle or some other ones. And now 
let's get her ready as if she was from 2021. And one thing is for sure, in the middle 1800s, which is the time period that she takes place, they wouldn't even have this many clothes in their closet. It would have been more like this. Because from Kirsten's time period, there wasn't a lot of options in their closet. They would have a fancy dress, maybe for Sundays, and they would have a, maybe a school outfit, play outfit, and then of course night clothes. And so, you know, sometimes they might have two of their workday clothes so they could be cleaning one while wearing the other. There wasn't a whole lot to choose from. With that being said, let's go ahead and let's change her from an 1800s closet to 2021. Ta-da! There is a closet for a girl of 2021. We went from the 1800s to today. We just have to decide what we want to try on her first. I think I have an idea. And here is outfit number one. So you guys decide which outfit that I'm going to show you is best for Kirsten 2021. So what do you think? I think this is super cute on her. So she's got the cable knit little top and the little checked pants and then of course those adorable boots. And then we even added the cute little owl necklace. I'm already getting worried that this is gonna be harder for me to choose than I thought it was gonna be. So there's outfit number one, remember that one. And now let's try outfit number two. So she has on the American Girl a bow sweater, a soft flannel argyle skirt from Elite Doll World on Etsy. And then she has on these little boot socks along with her actual meat boots. So there is outfit number two. So do you have a favorite yet out of the two? Let's go ahead and try outfit number three. Holy smokes, look how cute this third outfit is on her. Wow, they've all been cute, but this one probably is my favorite. It's perfect for her. It gives kind of her Sweden vibes. Let me tell you a little bit about it. So I'm almost positive the top is from Sasha Lee on Etsy. Not 100%, but I'm pretty sure. The shorts and the suspenders are. And then she has on just black tights and then again, her meat boots. You know, I, I thought I was gonna put the little white boots on her for the last two outfits, but because of her Pleasant Company legs, they don't zip up. So we've been using her meat boots and even though we're taking her into 2021, you know what? We're bringing the boots along with us <laughs> because they really look how cute they look with that outfit. And they looked nice with the last outfit too. So the boots are coming right along. It's kind of nice to be able to transcend the time with the fashions, isn't it? But doesn't she look adorable? Love it. So here is our beautiful Kirsten traveling through time, dressing as a girl of 2021. So what do you guys think? Was your outfit your favorite? Was it one, two, or three? Well, you can let us know over on our Facebook page on We Imagine um, if you want to cast your vote. Thanks for joining us. This has been a lot of fun trying these different clothes on her and giving her a different look. So that's our collection for now. Until next time, bye.